next guest was here. She amazes with some of her 260 dog barks, and she's back today with more unbelievable animal calls from Lantana, Florida. Please welcome Jill Derringer. <laughs> Yeah. Welcome you. back. What's been going on since you've been here? A lot of people come up to me after seeing me on the show and uh, have me do all my calls for them, for the dogs. And oh, really? I, yeah, and then I do dog training for them and everything, so it's been pretty interesting. And that, you use the barks to train other exactly. dogs. The barks yep. actually help make you the alpha dog, is exactly. that right? Exactly. Exactly, you got it. And then when you go away... I train the people, too, so to they have that. to do noises just So they the have same. to bark at their dogs? Not bark, but... Growls and other things that they have to do. <laughs> Not bark, but growl at them. Yeah. <laughs> That's silly to make them bark. Um, now, can you do an, uh, the Irish wolfhound? Did you see the picture? You remember about long snouted dogs? But I can do it. But it has to you be You do like short young... snouted dogs. You don't right. do long snouted I can, but the thing is, it has to be a very young dog and a female. So this is it. A young female. <laughs> Establish that you are alpha between the two of us right now. <laughs> I'm very submissive right now. All right, you just did dogs last time, so can you do like, could you do a cat? Yeah. Can let's you do it? Let's say a cat, uh, let's do a kitten. Here's a kitten calling for its mother. Oh, wow. I've brought right up to me kittens, older cats, everything. They'll come running looking for this kitten. Yeah, if I would have been right next to you, them. I would have come over. <laughs> <laughs> and, and can then, you do like a cat, uh, do a cat, uh, do a cat in heat? <laughs> are going to be up to the TVs yeah. and everything yeah. right now. Because <laughs> my, I have a cat that brings me things, and, and she will bring toys to me. Right. And you can hear her from throughout the house, and she sounds, she wow, yeah. wow, Sunnies. wow, wow. <laughs> Very good. Wow. Um, can you do a cougar? Can you do a dolphin? Kingdom in here yeah, all of a exactly. sudden. And all yeah. the jungle, I know. Um, and what else do you do that's like, a, do you do a, the birds? Yeah, let's say a macaw that's like learned how to say hello and stuff. Hello. 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 All right. So your dog was here last time that, that said, I love you, in which I didn't believe. You brought your dog out, and it actually says, I love you. And now it says something else, right? But don't tell us what it is. Okay. We're, you're going to come back later in the show, yep. and your dog is going to speak for us again yep. with a new phrase. That's right. We're back and with Jill Derringer and her talking dog, Sandman. Sandman last time said, I love you. Sandman. And now there's a new, uh, how old is Sandman again? He's five and a half. Sandman is so sweet. You're such a good doggy. Oh, All right, so uh, let's, what's the new phrase? I don't want to. Now, it's after making him do it and do it and do it. He doesn't want to do it anymore, and he says, I don't want to. <laughs> so we'll see if we can get him to do it. And, of course, I have to bark for him to start going, so. Okay. <laughs> Say, I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> 